Hey, what's up guys? It's Gathalion and welcome back to Destiny. Today we have another exotic weapon review and overview. We're going to be taking a look at the last word, which is arguably the best hand cannon on Xbox. And it is up to par with the Hawk Moon, though I do like the Hawk Moon just a little bit more. This hand cannon is excellent because it is full auto, meaning you hold down the trigger and it just goes. And it has a really high fire rate. It has a lot of uh, perks to it that increase hit fire damage accuracy its exotic buff the last word actually gives you extra precision damage when firing from the hip so if you are the kind of player who's good at nailing those crits when you're firing from the hip then this is a pistol for you it has a very wild west feel to it uh, it has the perfect balance perk which i like like a lot high caliber rounds which will make enemies stagger more often single point sling which makes you switch your weapons faster and move quicker while aiming it's got aggressive ballistics, which has confusing language with more predictable recoil and then more recoil, but it gives you a little bit more impact. Uh, smart drift control, pr predictable recoil, and uh, penalty to range. And then I use soft ballistics, but these are really something that you could go through situationally. Um, I kind of like I kind of like this one a lot for PvP. It'll help you land those crits a bit better. And this is a pistol that I really use at close range, anyways. So um, this might be a perk that you would use in PvP more often. Uh, if you uh, if you want to use the high caliber rounds, that'll help stagger enemies. Though this won't really help you in PvP that much. I would recommend going with perfect balance in PvP. And then single point sling is good for uh, just getting the weapon out quickly, though. I tend to not use those ones, and I, I lean on, on the perfect balance as much as possible. But we're going to talk about the last word buff and the hip fire uh, bonus. This thing is meant to be fired from the hip. It is meant to be a sort of a run and gun, up close type weapon. I don't really see a lot of people using the last word from a distance. I, I recommend the Hawk Moon from a distance, and if you can't get the Hawk Moon, I'd recommend something like the Devil You Know for PvE, as it is arguably one of the best PvE hand cannons, if not the best legendary PvE hand cannon, um, even trumping um, uh, the Fatebringer in many ways, uh, if you don't have access to the Fatebringer. So like I said, if you can uh, get some crits on enemies while hip firing with this, if you're the kind of player who's good at hip firing, then good for you, man. And this will be a great pistol for you. It does only have eight bullets inside its magazine, but that is something you could deal with as it does reload pretty quickly, I suppose. It's not a really long reload time as far as... Uh, as far as hand cannons go, as you can see, when you do nail those precision hits with this thing, it absolutely obliterates enemies. And I, I think this is a really nice hand cannon, dude. Um, Xbox, guys, this is pretty much going to be one of the best hand cannons you could get. My favorite part about this thing is it has a little flip when you bring it out. <laughs> you know, it's, it's it's very Wild West. It's, it's, very, it's very dirty, hairy, too. So it's, you know, this thing is great, guys. Um... I would definitely give this thing, like, if I had to give it a rating, like a solid 9 out of 10 as far as hand cannons goes, if not a solid 10. On par with the Hawk Moon, which is arguably my favorite weapon inside the game. And and you can see that it just, it really tears into the enemies whenever you knock those precision shots into them. So, if you're going up against um, a big boss that you could get up in close on and has a big crit spot, then you're going to do a lot of damage with this. And, you know, don't be afraid to aim down sights with this pistol, because you still get that auto-fire, that fast fire rate, more damage. You just don't get the bonus precision damage that you get from aiming um, from hip fire. But uh, aiming down sights with this pistol is still just as good. Uh, as far as where you can pick this thing up, it's, you know, it's like other exotics in the game that don't happen to have a bounty for them. It, it It's up to luck, man. It's, you know, is RNG going to be on your side uh, to get this pistol? I don't know. RNG was on my side when I got this pistol. Uh, I believe I got it from the Nightfall, and that seems to be pretty common. I know a couple guys who have gotten it from the chest inside the Gorgon's maze that often drops exotic weapons. Uh, this thing is great because it will body shot kill most standard enemies like your dregs and stuff, as where some uh, hand cannons might take two shots uh, to kill uh, enemies like uh, the, your lower dregs and, and your acolytes and such. So definitely a good pistol. You guys should try to pick it up. Do your hunting for it. I, I say that like it's just that easy. Like, go pick one of these up today. Good luck finding one, because it's a terrific pistol, a lot of fun to play with, and you will absolutely decimate enemies from that hip fire, 
It is great, man. And the full auto is just brutal. Anyways, guys, that'll wrap it up for this review on the Last Word Hand Cannon. Uh, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all back inside Destiny.